Hi guys, 732 Review Crew here. I'm Mikey. I'm Joe. And I'm Mike. And we're back today with Battlestar Galactica Season 2, Episode 12. This one is Resurrection Ship Part, Part two. 2. Now this is going to be very interesting because right now, both the Battlestar Galactica and Pegasus are working together to destroy what we've learned is the Resurrection Ship, the ship that allows Cylons to kind of respawn when they're far from home. So it's good to know... Finally, we have some confirmation that there is a too far for them. Yeah, like the actual, some explanation behind it all. Yeah. yeah. And also, it's good to, you know, see that some Cylons don't care if they, you know, continue actually as a part of the collective. So, especially due to, you know, traumatic reasons. So, you know, very interested to see how this one goes. And to see who shoots yeah. first. And yeah, I want to see who shoots first. I hope it's Starbuck. We all do. Yeah, we, <laughs> I can't handle our, you know, Adama getting shot again, because I don't think Ty can hold the fleet together one more time. <laughs> but uh, he ready, can't. Ready to start this one, though. Thank you for joining us. We're starting this one in three, two, one. What? I guess he's, he's on the float. Yes, the attack was going bad. So you're gonna do this? Yeah, I'm gonna do it. Here. I could use some backup. You know better than that. Yeah. Uh, yeah. People have to have this, Kara. Trust. If we don't have this, then we really are no different than the Cylons. Oh. You know, the man you killed saved my life and the lives of 50 other men, you miserable frack. Hey. You? You call me, sir. The glass. I can't hear you. So why don't Take you open the, the door, come in, and we'll talk about it in here. I love this. Do it. I love this. Uh-oh. <laughs> don't worry, sir. We'll take it real slow, What are they doing? Sir. Oh god. What are they doing? I'm worried. They're gonna put soap in a uh sock and then beat him. Yeah. <laughs> oh. These people suck, yeah. Those men in there, are they wearing colonial uniforms? Yes, sir. They killed Lieutenant Shut your fucking mouth! God, I like him. Yeah. I hope he doesn't suck at the yeah. end. I think I saw you two knuckle draggers treating those men like they were asylum, mm. both subject to charges of assaulting a chief. And a I like this. Thank you. I don't want your thanks. He was trying to rape a prisoner. You can't rape a machine, Lieutenant. Inevitably. Each and every one of us will have to face a moment where we have to commit that horrible sin. If we let our conscience get in the way, you know what happens? There are more kids in those body bags. Now, I don't know why, but I have a lot of faith in you. And I want you to promise me that when that moment comes, you won't flinch. Crazy how she's talking up her own executioner like that. Mm-hmm. So I'm got, uh, okay, I mean, if that's what you want. Jeez. That was, that was good. Assassination. That's your decision. If you're going to have some problem backing up Starbuck, I can find somebody else. It's not about me watching her back. This was a very hard decision. But I think the president's right. The pre the president. <laughs> it's hard to believe that she did that. Mom and dad both want to kill new mom. Stepmom. Should never be new mom. Stepmom. Good hunting, Captain. Good hunting, Colonel. <laughs> I mean, I thought he would look back or something like that. What does she mean by that? The last thing we need is the colonial shooting at each other. I'm into that. <laughs> Ty suspects nothing. I don't know. He said, I'm into that. I've asked you here to find out why the Cylons hate us so much. Huh. I'm not sure I know how to answer that. It's what you said at the ceremony. You said that humanity was a flawed creation. You said that humanity never asked itself why it deserved to survive. 
Maybe you don't. <laughs> Still don't answer why. Base stars. Ooh, they're Ooh. actually hitting it. Let's go. That was a jump. Ooh. Woohoo! Target's FTL is history, she's all yours. Nice. Red wing initiated attack right now. Oh. What, what was that? Fuck? Watch your intervals. This is crazy. Must be so surreal. I'd say so. And you have to just sit there. Cause you don't want to burn up oxygen. Oh. Uh-oh. Oh, God. Oof. <sighs> wow. That's sick. Wow. Set secondary battery. Wow. Look at, look at, oh. Dude, this is fucking awesome. Yeah. This is amazing. This is awesome. This is all we wanted to see since episode one. Yeah, uh, this battles. <laughs> <laughs> the battle starts battling. Yeah. Tens of thousands, Gaius. God will not forgive this sin. Do you think God will forgive us? God forgives all. Don't listen to her. Do you know what I miss most? You're going to laugh when I tell you this. Sports. Sports. The same lie she told him? Mm-hmm. What's That's everyone's game plan here? What's happening? Two tickets. No. She's playing two roles in one scene and it's crazy. Oxygen deprivation is causing him to feel like he's there. I'm sorry, here. Wow. So fucking cool. There's no way he dies right now. Wow. I mean, it's silent. They absolutely fucking pummeled that one ship yeah. while taking a Ooh. beating from the other one. That's crazy. Ooh. That's crazy. The like drifting. Yeah. <laughs> oh all my the god. Bodies. Is it all just her? Uh I feel like they have some of her. That's all they showed us though. It was just her. Probably not to spoil who the other six are. Mm. That'd be too easy. Damn, they just blew the whole thing up. Yeah, that's crazy. There's a raptor. Okay, alright. He's not a silent. That dude, if he died, I would that would have been off. They've done. Yeah. He doesn't seem excited. He's not very good at hiding his emotions right there, too. He's not. Is she gonna wait for the phone call? Well, she doesn't have Apollo now either. Your hand off your gun, Kara. Dude, she's literally Boomer. I know. I, I was noticing that parallel. <laughs> I was like, bruh. I am so very proud of you. Fuck. It's that's so crazy the parallel. Oh, he never got the call. Flagship, sir. Uh oh. Admiral Kane on the line. He's hoping he didn't get the call. Thank fuck. Is Starbuck with you? Yes, she is. <sighs> is this Starbuck? It's not enough to survive. Hmm. One has to be worthy of surviving. That's all. And do it. Commander, I wonder if my XO is standing close by. Yes, he is. Fuck. He He's really writing this. Do. Yeah. That's all. They both stood down. I think she knew. She's like, okay. No, she wouldn't do that. What are they doing? Oh, by the way, uh, there was something I wanted to tell you. Last night, I was walking down this corridor here when I saw this. <gasps> Why'd she let him kill him? I can't. I can't do this. Suicide is a sin. Yeah. But I Good need call. to die. What you need is just. Is Baltar gonna go on a rampage? <laughs> go, go start shooting. Oh, good call. Oh, bro. What the f 
Go start. Yo, is she gonna kill the admiral? <gasps> please, 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 please oh my shoot God. her. That would be the best Back possible situation. Altar, bro. Dude. Just. Sh <sighs> yes! How did she get in there? Please do it! Can you roll the fur? Pick. Frack you. Shoot her. Do it. You're not my type. Oh, I'm so cathartic. Baltar, oh my god. Baltar has, has literally been integral to like every major plot point. It's kind he's of the main character. <laughs> but he's like the bad guy. No, right? he isn't, is he? I mean, he's God's chosen. He's God's chosen one. And as I take command of Pegasus, I pledge to uphold those values that made her such an effective and heroic leader. You think he just Adama's that? leading officer again. Even with his promotion to take over Pegasus. We're all good. Everything's fine. Is he? Yeah. One ship. No help. No hope. She didn't give up. She did what she thought needed to be done, and the Pegasus survived. But I think that we were safer with her than we are without. Yikes. Are you okay? No. Not really. I wasn't there when you needed me. A close call like that? That'd mess with anybody's head. Why is he there? They're friends. Why is he there, Mike? They're friends. He's in denial. I didn't want to make it back alive. Mm -hmm. What? I didn't think I'd ever see you again. <laughs> yeah. Good guy, Chief. He is. He's an awesome character. Sleep for about a year, but, but you, however, do not have that luxury because you have a new job. Is she making him an admiral? Someone who commands more than one ship is called an admiral. Oh, so he does that rank the other guy. Okay. He's promoted. Yeah. Mom and dad. Mom got dad a gift. Congratulations. No, it's not fleet, everyone's just admiral. Just goes to show you, Bill. Never give up, up. Oh, it took oh. was the end of all you know. Yeah, come on, Miracle. <gasps> I think Six has healing powers and can heal her. <gasps> I got you an organ donor. Yeah! yeah! Well, you guys are super hyped about that. Mom and Dad! Huh? Mom and Dad! <laughs> Did Does he you... smack have another brother? <laughs> <laughs> Billy's just like, okay. <sighs> wow. That gave me everything I wanted. We can stop watching Battlestar now. You said that last time. I you? got I got my battle scene. I got I got the, the evil admiral was murdered by a Cylon, so Adama's honor is intact. A lot of redemption. Mom and dad got a kiss. A lot of redemption. So I mean, I mean, obviously the highlight of this entire episode was the, the battle scene. Seeing actually two battle stars fighting two base stars and a Cylon uh, resurrection ship was awesome. And just just how they portrayed the, the scene right there didn't have to show us the, the fight for long enough. We could have, you know, imagine that it was, they were just brawling with like auto cannons versus like missiles and stuff like that. It was cool to say. Well, what else was it? It was also our first truly offensive battle. Yeah, right. It was mm -hmm. our true. No, it was our truly our first offensive battle where we did something and kind of in that way, we, we did the biggest thing possible, which is killing the Cylon Resurrection ship. And everything worked yeah. out great. And now there's two battle stars and the whole fleet's yeah. all intact. Now, remember in, in like the first like episode or whatever, I was like, maybe this show's about them getting all the battle stars back up line. Yeah. Number two, we only have 10 more to go. There was, uh, <laughs> there was, in this, there was like a bunch of tension off the rip because we knew what missions were. Um, but even between the, the two in prison and the guards who came in to beat them, but we learned that even though there's some tension, they still deserved respect because they weren't Cylons, which just goes to show the um, Pegasus's viewpoints even further was truly, even though they may have collaborated with a Cylon in their eyes, they still were humans and therefore deserved to be treated right. better. And even yes. they, though they were prisoners, they were higher ranks than the guards and everybody. So they, sure. they shouldn't have been beat because... It looks like that the reason is on that ship, you know, they demand respect. 
you will be killed if you fight it. Oh, they, they follow the code of yeah. conduct to like the letter. I agree. Which you know, it's it's very nice to see that honor system coming through from at least one side because we know that uh, our guys on the um, the Battlestar Galactica don't you know really have the same towards the people on the Pegasus. You know, in that sense, they you know because they're more family. So because they won't shoot somebody if they. <laughs> I don't understand. You said they have more no, honor. No, the respect. Ah! Oh, respect. but it's fear. But it's fear. Yeah. It's fear-based respect versus the family respect. You have, you have, sure. you have the frigate yes. ship that's... Sure. You know, but, Fearful respect is a real thing. Not to be understated that they didn't uh, work as an effective unit as a Battlestar because they were alone for many weeks and survived on an offensive fight against an enemy that outnumbered them. The Pegasus. Yeah, the Pegasus. Six months. It was, yes. Yeah, they, no, but before they met anybody by themselves and started cannibalizing ships for stuff, they were uh, by themselves further. Yeah, I mean, they're assholes. Mm -hmm. They are, but they're soldiers. I mean... I but, know, so, it's a time of war, but like I said, and they never yeah. addressed it, the war is over. Yeah, it is like, over. The war is over. Right. They lost. But if you're looking at this from a purely outsider standpoint, well, technically the Pegasus is the ship in the, the correct... Uh, besides the entire abuse of prisoner way they did because of, I mean, but the, they have no, enemies as no, prisoners of but war. Like, the, the difference is, yes. if you operate under the belief the war is ongoing and yes. humanity hasn't yes. lost, then sure, the Pegasus, you can say, is in the right yes. and Galactica is in the wrong. But the reality is that mankind is on its right. You're ignoring the most important difference between Galactica and Pegasus. It's the fact that Laura Roslin... It's president it, versus no, yeah, right. She, and the fleet, because she was the one who like yelled at Adama. I was like, "What are you doing? Like, we have all of these people here." Remember, it was a huge deal when they left the people without the FTL drives. Sure. And after that, she was like, "What the fuck? Like, chill the fuck out. Well, we have people here." Too, but and there was no one to do that for Admiral Kane. Baltar, yeah. bro. Now, does, is she gonna live with him, bro? Baltar really just be wilding out. Is he doing that because she's a real one and, and not a fake one, so he can like actually touch her and not be crazy? Well, that's what I was trying to say earlier, but you, you, you saw, which was her, because I'm just going to start. I know we killed one, but I brought home another copy. But, so imagine, <laughs> imagine the, the most important person in your entire life, Mike, <laughs> and you lose them and you think you will never, ever, ever, ever see them again, ever. Yeah. And here they are and not the same person, but the same person. Which is already a sister. mind fuck. Yeah, I get it. But in addition to that, the person you remember is now instead a dog. A dog, essentially, that has been beaten within an inch of its life. What? And has nothing. My dog. They, there were comparisons when we first see number six that they, like, it's like an abused dog, right? Literally beg, roll over. Yes. yes. Oh, yeah. yeah. They're treating her like, it, like it's a dog and they're abusive owners. Yeah. What up? No, I kind of forgot where I was going. He interrupted you after asking not to be interrupted like three times. Uh, <laughs> no, I had to ask for a clarifying question. No, I get what you're saying, where you were talking about how the love of your life, you finally see her twin yes. sister yes. being abused. So obviously, Baltar, it would be impossible to not feel for her in that position. I, I mean, free fun. her. <laughs> I, I thought he was going to shoot her. You know what? I thought if, he was going to yeah. do it. This is actually all Hilo's fault. If Hilo had not given up his spot for Baltar, none of this would be happening. Shh, I mean, right. you're not wrong. You're right. Dan. I'm just saying I totally understand why Baltar did what he did. The only thing I don't understand about it is how no video cameras saw him do any of that. And sneak There's like the no ship. cameras on that. There's Dude, actually no they, cameras I, on this ship. No one cares about the vice president because otherwise you'd think they'd be like, hey, where's the vice president? Where'd he go? Is he down? Is he okay? Does he, like, where's his aid? Like, nobody knows shit. He just fucking yeah. everyone's like he's a genius dude i don't know you're no but weird. that's like real life vice presidents so they're just like mm, go, yeah. go talk at a college or something dude you're like <laughs> you were on vacation <laughs> so much happened uh one thing that what else have we not talked about because lee, lee didn't want to live oh yeah that was uh, the low yeah, point yeah, of that was that was uh is it just he's tired of fighting i think it's the demotion it's the the getting at each other's throats i think it's just the human conditions eating at him i mean it's been six months of this and and he's been holding up. Means they've been looking time. for Earth for six months so too. He hasn't had his opportunity it's, it's, to break. It's at least like three months of jumping from random stage systems being like, Earth, are you here? No, okay. Yeah, plus he's, Terrible. he keeps finding himself in bad dis uh, bad spots because of difficult decisions he made. 
mm-hmm. and mm-hmm. maybe you didn't always make the right decision. That's fair. You know? We did not always make the right, right? decision. He never picked sides. But he lives side. with it, and you're right, and he hasn't showed any cracks of that up until right now. He has, but he's never, like, broken down. Sure, yeah, yeah, yeah. And this was him pretty much admitting, like... It's wearing on him. I was he's... okay with dying in that moment. Yeah. Because, like, everyone else has had a traumatic moment to, like, reset their emotions. He's has really been like what his dad dying like that sucks but that's and traumatic but like not like a full emotional reset. Hmm. Hilo was on Caprica and got back. That was a whole tra- trauma. Yeah, Hilo's been through Starbuck. Good Starbuck. I mean, uh, this <laughs> it's just nothing constant of events. And the commander Adama got shot. He literally got to take a time out. Joe and, thinks I, that D likes Lee. Dealy, I mean, they're, they're, one time it didn't mean anything. A second time that there was even any type of yeah, whatever, yeah, they're friends, dude. Well, they, there's they're clearly pushing some background story to the forefront sometimes. Well, this is what's going to cause Billy to act going on. Maybe they've her and Billy haven't been able to see each other because of all the stress of stuff, and he's helping the president, she's sick, and that's what's happening. And you know, uh, what's it called? Um, Starbuck is thinking about. Sam, uh, Anders, so Lee is like, eh. Sure, hey. Um, which, was, like, just kind of, yeah. Makes I, sense to that. I'm trying to think what yeah. else. There's, um, I mean, just, you know, the president and the, I guess, admiral now, congratulations. Kiss. Kiss which is, Mommy I guess, dad. people, just people are just getting, like, you know, very lonely and, and, you know, breaking down a little bit, too, with their, you know, defenses after... You know, being so on edge for a few weeks, it felt like because people didn't know who Cylons were and we had to survive first. And now we're kind of used to people and know them. And it's just like, you know, OK, well, even if we don't survive, because he knows she has terminal cancer. He's, you know, he's yeah. like, well, it's a comfort thing. You know, you're here for me. I'm here for you. And it's a mutual respect. I, I, I mean, no, I guess doesn't make you kiss people necessarily, but I mean, sure, but sure, oh, they're both saying, oh, they're both in an age group. Do it right after the Admiral thing. And yeah, Thanks for okay. promoting me fair plus they've had tension since uh oh yeah 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 like dancing dancing in the book the book thing yeah yeah hey uh do you think starbuck would have done it done what yeah 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 Yeah. i think she was yeah yeah i think it would haunt her but yeah i think everybody would have done it the exo i don't know the exo man dude that was so well shot because literally every time something happened they went back to his face and he was like and they were like, sir, it's a call from the fleet saying congratulations. <sighs> ring, ring. <gasps> it happened like three or four times before it was actually, oh, hey, she wants to talk to you. And he was like, oh, God damn it. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> so I like that. That was That's good. I don't one. know. I feel like Do you he, think he would have, but only out of like fear. fear. Do you think he's going to be a good commander or like, you know, or is he just going to? I'll be shocked if mean? the Pegasus makes it past this season. <laughs> You think, that, you think he's going to be like, like not like Ty, how Ty went power hungry? No, or... I think he's going to be great. I don't think it's going to be. He's gonna die, though? I, I think the Cylons are going to come full force because they've just dealt a, gotten essentially their first victory since losing the war. Right? True. Like actual victory. Well, the, the expectation is the Cylons are actually going to leave them alone. No, I think the first victory I would say since losing the war would have been finding Cobol and do the arrow. Yeah, and they had small. They did blow up a base star. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah you're right. Star and then yeah. They That's a big okay. victory, I think, because it's a moral victory. Knowing, but this is a big blow. This is a military victory. That was yes, a moral this victory. is like a strategic yeah. victory. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that was like that was like kind of like well, you fight a few enemies and you take control of the town again. This one's like we killed like their because mi- it's yeah, uh, uh, yeah. yeah. That's why I'm wondering like, is that how many resurrection ships are there? Because I can't believe there's one. So there's one for each one. There's got to be like at least a dozen, right? It, plus, you have to remember that no, there's nine, so no, fleet of three ships was designated specifically just to follow. That's what I'm Galactica. saying. Like, I think it's a, it, everything's in dozens, so I feel like it's a dozen. There's a dozen Ballastars, a dozen Pons, a dozen. Only saw number six is on. Dozen gods. Dozen gods. Uh, it's got to be a dozen ships. Which could mean there are, but now, what if that means number six, like, that that was number six shit. I don't think it was number six of shit. I think it was. I think they have because uh, no, because well, oh, that wouldn't make sense because that number sense. six wasn't even on the Galactica. She was on the uh, Pegasus. So you're right. Yeah, if anything, it would. It's been a couple of each. 
that we know of. Yeah. Well, it looked like a couple, like, thousand of them. Well, each. that's why I was kind of, I kind of wish I could see, like, a still and count to see, like, how many, like... It didn't seem... Because it seemed like each bay had 12 in them. Yeah. Hmm. I don't got anything else to add, though. All right, if we're done with the list, yeah, no, I want to get to the next one because that was a very spirited debate, fun. and uh, I can only imagine what's next. Rabble, <laughs> yeah, rabble, rabble. Not. Uh, thank you for joining us for the 732 Review I am Mikey. I'm Joe. And I'm Mike. If you do enjoy our Rabble, 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 make sure you check out our Patreon, which just features full length Rabble, Rabble, Rabbles, and many other things. Uh, if you do enjoy the stuff, let us know in the comments below. If you think somebody's right in the argument, if you think somebody's really wrong in the argument, your favorite part of the argument. Otherwise, make sure you like and subscribe if you haven't already. See you next time. Bye. Bye. Bye.